Hi, Jazz Air Cuties, Wendy here. Today we're going to draw Augie from Augie and the Cockroaches. So let's get started. To draw this silly and very lazy cat, let's first start by drawing his eyes. So I'm going to come right here and draw two ovals. And they're going to be stuck together. So let's draw the other one right here, right next to it. Now that we have that in, let's come in and we're going to draw another oval. Smaller one right in the middle. And here as well. Then I'm going to go in here and shade this in with a little highlight right there. And same thing here. Okay, so now that we have that in, let's draw the really big red nose. So right underneath these eyes, I'm going to come right under a curve. It kind of slowly goes upwards a little bit, and then we're going to round it off about right here. Nice and big. And then let's come back over here. We're going to round it off. And let's connect it. So it's like a big jelly bean. But this side is much wider. And connect. <laughs> there. And then from there, let's draw the mouth. So I'm going to come to the side, uh, let's say about right here where the nose is. I'm going to come out nice and wide. So let's say about right here. And then I'm going to come to the other side and it's going to be a lot closer on this side. So let's say about right here, I'll give myself a point. So from these two points, I'm going to come curve and I'm going to go right underneath the nose. This big smile right underneath and we're going to curve all the way back up back to here Got a big smile and let's come back right in here we're going to add this curve right here to cap it off and another one so same thing on this side curve out and another curve and it looks really weird with this nose and it's not colored in huh round this off a little bit more to make it smoother okay so then from there let's come back underneath and we're going to draw an open mouth so i'm going to come about right here i'm going to draw a curve that comes down and about right here as well and before i close it off i'm going to draw this tongue so let's come back over here i'm going to draw a curve and another curve and we'll come all the way down and right back up. There. Get the wider and then whatever space you have left, just go ahead and close it off. And let's see here. Then from there, let's draw the top of the head so we can bring this together and make it look like a cat. So let's come right back up over here where the nose is, close to the eye. And I'm going to go up, following my eye, and I'm going to come over the eye, come right back to the center, and around the other side, and about right there, before I touch the nose, I'm going to stop. Then let's come back right here. We're going to taper this, continuing this curve for the top of the head. So we're just going to go up nice and high. Come to the sides right here, then stop. So we're just creating this dome over the eyes for the head. And then about right here, we're just going to cut it off <laughs> for the head part. And then from there, let's draw the ears. So nice pointy ears, so say about right here, I'm just going to go up and down. And same thing over here, up and down. From there, let's start to draw the sides of the face. It's coming together, right? <laughs> let's come over here and we're going to curve out and nice and wide. Curve and bring it right back in. So on this side, it's going to be not as wide as this side. So, but we're going to do the same thing. So say about right here, kind of in this area. I'm just going to go around the mouth. And in. So 
it's just wider just make sure it's wider on this side because he's slightly looking um, towards this side a little bit more not straight on then from there I totally forgot his teeth so let's go right here we're gonna add two teeth right there and then his whiskers so I'm gonna come right here and draw a circle and before I finish off the circle I'm gonna come in here with another curve and pop out his whiskers so this is all black just shade that in and same thing over here so circle come back in here with a curve and out there and two more on this side so same thing And one more right here. There, got his whiskers in. Maybe a little too thick. <laughs> Let me come in here and um, I think I made them a little too thick. It's kind of scary, right? But you get the idea. They're not supposed to be weapons, they're just whiskers. There, much better. From there, let's go ahead and start to draw the body. So I'm gonna bring this down and around the tongue area so we draw like the neck area and then I'm going to go and draw the shape for the body so come out and we're gonna round it off and round it off and about right here it's connected at the bottom of a curve <laughs> there Okay, so now that we have that shape, then we need to add the arms and the legs. So I'm going to come about right in this area. Right here, I'm going to curve out these silly arms. Curve out. And right here, I'm going to stop it and then draw the hands. So curve out on both sides. And let's start these fingers. So we're going to come out in for the thumb and then longer one about right here and then towards the center we're going to add one that curves in and then one more that pops out and come right back in and then right here just going to draw a little curve for a detail and then the other one so the other one will start the same area but this one's going to come down Oh, so we'll say about right here. And I'm going to cut it off once again. Add this curve right here. And then the thumb. And let's see here. Let's go this way. I'm going to start with this long finger that comes in. Then come out right here just trying to follow these <laughs> fingers here come back in and then one's going to be tucked underneath so imagine it coming through and back there we did it <laughs> so hopefully it helped you draw that and then now for the feet so i'm going to come to this side right here and we're just going to come down with a curve down a little bit thinner on this side and then we're going to go up with the foot and connect at the bottom and then let's add two curves right here and so this side is going to be a different so about right here I'm going to start this way it's going to curve in this way and a little bit um, higher than this foot so I'll end it about right here and we're going to go out and just go ahead and connect and then cut it off right there and add 
two curves right here for the toes and a tail so about right here in whatever space you have left i'm just gonna pop in this big curve for the tail and then uh, finally we have this belly area very uh, detailed cat right very complicated so i'm just gonna come right here and draw this big oval for the tummy And then right here, we're going to draw this swirl. So I'm going to come over here and swirl my way across. So they're all done. I really hope I helped you draw Augie here from Augie and the Cockroaches Fun and Easy. Thanks so much for watching. And if you loved it, please make sure to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.